Hi guys, it's Alex here, and today I'm doing the match preview for the Colchester v Notts County game. I think the Colchester will beat Notts County on the weekend, as we have a good, very good team this season, and a team that I think can beat Notts County, and that is capable of beating Notts County, because so we've got Brennan Dickinson, who been good when once he came back from injury, he was good, he was good at the beginning of the season, He's just a really good player, Brennan Dickinson, and a good good signing, I think, anyway. And um, I think Guthrie up front, doing all right. Um, got some goals this season. We've got, like, Ray Reich, Craig Slater. Players that are good. In, we brought in good players this season, and we are... 16th, 15th in the league, which isn't too bad really. Um, Notts County are a decent team and they have got some good players, but I think I still think that we can beat them as Notts County did lose their last game 2 0 at home against Wickham. And um, that's why I seriously think we can win. We drew against Mansfield 0 0, we did away at Mansfield, Cole, you did on their last game. Which is a good result for us, really, and um, so I think that we're we're in good form. We are sixteenth in the league, and Notts County are twentieth. So, um, I think that we'll win because because I think we got a good team, and yeah, um, in here is my team lineup prediction. <clears throat> in goal. Sam Walker, right back Richard Brindley, two centre backs Frankie Kent and Tom Eastman, left back George Elikobi, right mid Slater, two central midfields players Garvin and Lapsley, uh, left mid Dickinson and up front I'm going with the two up front is Bond and Curtis Guthrie. <clears throat> now the reason I'm going with Bond <clears throat> is because um, Johnston isn't doing very well, isn't playing very well up front, hasn't really got much goals. He's got one goal, I think, this season. And I don't think he really suits the play style that we play, really, and it's a shame, because like, I thought he would do well for us, but clearly he isn't working out for him. Um, so I've gone with Bond instead, and Curtis Guffey keeps his place, I think, because he's been playing well. Please like and subscribe, but until then I shall see you in my next video. Thanks, bye.